Hey guys, it's Robert here, just um, on the way back home from another trip, yet another trip to the supermarket. Um, just never seem to quite have enough food in. It's crazy, absolutely crazy. But anyway, that's, um, that's a rant I'll have for another day. Today I just wanted to, to make a quick video while I'm driving home to just talk to you about dumbing it down. Um, it's just trying to avoid running into a double-decker bus here. But the importance of dumbing it down a little bit. Uh, these days on the internet, all you're bombarded with is, um, you know, stuff about, or videos about mainly, videos about, you know, the importance of having automation and the importance of, you know, making everything look really plush and perfect online, high quality high quality videos and another one this is an absolute bottleneck here luckily I can reverse um, yeah and and uh, and what I really wanted to kind of point the finger at a little bit is the kind of connection with who you're reaching out to and the potential for disconnect the more that you go kind of high-tech with all of your marketing stuff because um, certainly for people who are in, let's say, the home business niche um, and you're out there trying to help other people to be successful online, a lot of the time, the more kind of out of reach you look, the more gadgets that you employ and, and, and uh, the more polished your presentations, the more disconnect there is with the people that you're actually um, you know, trying to serve because they look at the stuff that you're dishing up and they think, well, there's no possible way I can do that. And that's a very real problem. So that's why I have no problem myself doing these silly little videos in the car on the way home from the supermarket. Why? Because do you know what? If you've got um, an iPhone or an Android phone these days, you can, you can make a video. And surely guys, surely the content is still the most important thing. Surely it's not really the, um, you know, we're not trying to make feature films. This isn't Hollywood. What we're trying to do is we're trying to share great content that makes a difference in people's lives or in their businesses and that helps them in some way. That's what it's all about. The value is in the content, not in the quality of the video. As long as it's good enough for you to hear what's being said and see what's going on, then I think that's good enough, don't you? And so really, I just wanted to kind of throw that out there and, and say to you, if, if right now you're finding yourself a little bit overwhelmed, you know, wondering about what sort of video equipment you need and, you know, whether or not, you know, your autoresponder Aweber is good enough or whatever the heck it is that you're using, um, Try not to lose sight of the fact that, you know what, the content is what it's all about. Your ability to make a difference in the world, a difference to the people that you're serving, is what it's all about. And your, your customers or your, your prospects, your audience, they have no idea what you're using to deliver that stuff with. They only see what they see. And what I think you need to remember to do and what I'm certainly reminding myself to do every day is stay on the level, be successful using tools that you know others can duplicate your success using. I see so many people these days coming out with fancy marketing funnels, etc., and selling selling them to people as a you know as a kind of uh, quick fix for more leads and, and customers and clients and all this sort of stuff. And then quite often they're pitching these things at people who are, who are operating with more basic systems than they've got their hands on, which makes it absolutely null and void and inoperable. And it, it makes me quite irritated, to be honest. And that's why, to, to some extent, I know there has to be expansion, automation. Sometimes you, your business will outgrow certain tools. But I like to try and do most of my stuff using the basic stuff that everybody's got their hands on so I know that whatever I'm teaching to people um, about you know making money online or having success online in whatever niche they're in can be done using the tools the strategies and the tactics that I'm employing for myself 
right now. Does that make sense? Because, um, you know, if, if all of my success is based on these highfalutin tools that the majority of the audience that I'm speaking to can't afford to use in their business right now, then to me that's not being completely transparent and to me that's also being a tad dishonest. So, in summary, what I want you to do is remember that your message is what's important. Um, not how polished your videos are and not what email autoresponder you're using to, uh, to give that information to your audience. So concentrate your time on just being you. Concentrate on making the things that make you special right now even more incredible and get your message out to as many people as you can every single day and forget about the rest. That will take care of itself. Okay, you are the most important thing in your business, not your autoresponder and certainly not your video camera. Okay, just use your iPhone, use Aweber or something basic and just concentrate your time on being you and delivering the value that is you. Okay, so I went on a bit. I'm a little bit passionate about that, but food for thought, I think, don't you? Um, take it away with you, do what you will. Hopefully, if you're in that position right now, it'll prompt you to make some changes. I hope you're having a terrific day wherever you are. <laughs> I'm in the UK and it's just started to rain again. <laughs> oh dear, never mind. Have a great day wherever you are and check in again soon. Don't forget to, um, to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and if you haven't already, go over to my blog, robertcbrown.online, and check out some of the great stuff I've got going on over there, and just stay connected, okay? Take good care, speak soon. Cheers.